What's up everyone, Takedown here, welcome back to another video. Today, of course, is another hockey card video, and I'm going to be opening up these championship collection boxes you can find at Walmart. They're $15, they include one autograph relic, uh, one autograph card, sorry, one autograph relic, and four sealed packs. Normally I get a score pack, a series one, series two of the same year, and then a Parkhurst pack. That's what to expect. Now the first box of these that I opened... I didn't get too much, as you can see, one of the cards is at the top left corner. The other one I got, the last box I opened of these, I got amazing. I got a dual jersey with P.K. Subain, and I also got an Alex Tangay autographed card. So that box was definitely well worth it. I've yet to look up the prices and the value of the cards, but I'm going to be doing that very soon. So let's just open this up, and hopefully we have the same luck as the last box. Let's get right into it. That one didn't open as smoothly. Here we go. Just like the last ones, I'm going to try my best not to show you guys all the cards. I'm going to see what we get. Okay, so just like last time, we have a score pack. We have a Parkhurst pack, same year as last time as well. And we have a Series 1 and Series 2 of 18 and 19. So I'm getting the same packs consistently. I bought them at the same location. So I'm hoping if you purchase at other locations, you'll be able to find other packs within it. Because this box here that has 16 factories sealed, which is from Championship Collection as well, it shows right on it packs from uh, 16, 17, uh, 15, 16, you have packs from the 90s, so I'm hoping it's just this location that uh, is where I found these ones. So I'm going to open up this pack first, the score pack. I'm definitely going to buy more of these in the future. I'm really excited. Let's get started. Up first, we have Tyler Ennis. Not too bad. A Tory Mitchell. I think I got one of his cards last time, but not from the score. Uh, Mike Ribeiro. Ryan Johansson. Steven, Scam Steven Stamp goes season highlights. Also, I will butcher names. I think you guys are well aware of that. Just another heads up, if you will. Eric Brewer. And I don't know if that was a... Insert or not, because the border is a little bit different. But then we also have a Brendan Dillon, Hot Rookies. So not too bad, uh, Steven Stamkos. So that's an uh, interesting one for me to add to my collection, because I don't have too many, if any, of his cards. Um, I'll have to definitely piece together a PC of them, because I do end up finding quite a few of his cards. Uh, now we're going to go to the Parkhurst, which I absolutely hate getting, because they always stick together. I just don't like my cards doing that, especially when I'm buying them. So, Sean Monahan, David Pasternak. This one's not too bad. I don't know if I have it. Connor McDavid. You guys know I have a small PC of his, so I'll have to see if that's an included one. Uh, Trevor Daly. I like this one, but it's stuck together. Even more so once I've seen who it is, it is a NHL Sentinel Salutes for Jaeger. And I got one in the last video. This has a nice shine to it, too. That's amazing. Definitely going to check that one out. I'm going to put it over here so it doesn't blind the camera. I have a small PC of his, so that one, that one gets me excited. I'm really excited to see what else we have. Also, a Jonathan Bernier which I have a small PC of his as well. So I'm doing really good with this pack, even though I do not like Parkhurst. Uh, Sebastian Aho. A uh, Joel Ward. I don't think I have this one, but I have enough for a small PC of his. Also, this last one here, Aho, was a rookie's. I didn't even notice that at first. Apologies. Oh, this one's really stuck together, these two. Here we go. A Daniel Sedin. Nice. I'll have to check that one. And Artem, let it focus. Anismov. I'm going to say it's that. 
I'll put it here. So that's really good. I got a Jaeger card. That's a definitely one for my PC. So I'm really excited to see where it fits in my PC. Now I'm going to do an 18, 19 upper deck. I'm amps. I'm amps. These videos, uh, these boxes alone were definitely well worth it. And if they're at your Walmart near you, I would definitely recommend picking them up. I'm having a struggle with this pack here. I don't know why. I always struggle with one pack per video at least. Johnny, focus, come on. Johnny Godreau. Should have put that like that. There we go. Seth Jones. Zach Prezi. Stonewalled for Linus Allmark. I don't think I have any of these ones, so that's a nice one to add to my goalie collection. Matthias Eklom. I think I picked that one up not too long ago. Uh, Jonathan Druin. I just got that one in the last video as well. Uh, Carl Soderberg. I just got that one as well. That's kind of a downer for me. But Kyle Connor as well. So not too bad. Nothing fancy. Uh, I did get a couple cards. Um, nothing of too much value though. So now we're going to do the Series 2 for 1819 to see what we can find. All right, up first, Corey Schneider. Another one, Jonathan Bernier. I know I don't have this one for my small PC of his, so two Jonathan Bernier in the same video. Can't complain on that. Marcus Kruger. Alex, oh, let it focus here. Alex Killorn. I uh, have an upper deck portrait. I always get these for the second one here. Sam Steele. I'm going to put it here to see if I can put it in my APC. Zach Wierenski. Patrick Laney. I love that Jets jersey. And a Charlie, Charlie Coyle. It's not too bad. I managed to pick up a few cards. But now we have the best part, and in my opinion, my favorite part of getting these boxes. So $15 not only gets you four packs, but it also gets you a relic card and a autograph card. So let's see what we have here. Up first, oh baby, am I excited. I didn't realize this was uh, one of his cards, but let's just show you guys here. A dual jersey card from Artifacts, including Rick Nash and Steve Mason. This is epic because I literally have a Rick Nash uh, small PC. I have a couple of his jersey cards. I think a couple videos ago, I shared a, whenever I found all these cards and got them off of eBay, I basically bought a lot of his cards, uh, including some jersey cards and numbered cards, but it's a video just of his cards. So I'm really excited. This one I'm amped for. That, that is a great card for me. I'm really excited for that. I was not expecting that. But Ooh, once again, this one here, I just got this same exact autograph in the last video, and you can see it in the top on uh, the video screen here. But it's an Alex Tangay as well. So this is the second one I got. Not too bad. I'm definitely going to have to check up the value of this now, because I'm definitely going to be including and keeping one for my personal collection, and then one I'll probably toss up on eBay, depending on how much it goes for on eBay and what it's worth or I'll see what I can do so we'll find out I'll let you guys know but I definitely definitely enjoy these videos I'm definitely going to be purchasing more of these in the future I managed to get just from the packs alone enough cards that I'm happy with just getting the four packs inside and adding some stuff and some players to my personal collection for each one but I'll also Getting and also guaranteeing one relic card, which this one's amazing, perfect for my PC. And then to get this one here, yes, it is a duplicate because I just got it, but it's awesome. I'll be able to see what it's worth, post it online, or give it away to somebody that collects that I know. So I'm really excited. Hope you guys are too. I'm going to leave this video here. Please take care. Peace.